Ayan, parang si Christine na yun. camera I guess in the hotel and it looks like you were having an argument with uh, one of the males there and it actually got kind of physical Ikaw ba'y naniniwala na maari pang kausapin ang kaluluha ng taong na mayapa na? Samahan ninyo akong panoorin ang nakakakilabot na pakikipag-usap ng isang international paranormal expert tas na may YouTube channel na Gold Rush. At ano ang naging kasagutan tungkol sa kanilang pakikipag-usap bagamat naglapa na ang mga haka-haka tungkol sa pagkamatay ng isang dalaga noong December 31 ng gabi upang ipagdiwang ang pagsalubong ng bagong taon. Ang tinutukoy ko ay isang dalaga na namaya pa noong December 31 ng gabi 2020 ay walang iba kundi si Christina Dacera. Karaming kontrobersyal sa kanyang pagkamatay. Sa magkabilang kampo ay naturally yung kanyang pagkamatay. Sa kabilang kampo naman ay pinaniniwalaan nila ang ginahasa ito at hanggang sa mamatay. Pero hindi, hindi po natin masasabi na ito'y dapat ng paniwalaan or hindi paniniwalaan. Pero isa lang yung masasabi ko dito guys. Nakakakilabot yung kanilang pakikipag-usap. Kaya tuwag na natin patagalin at panoorin na natin. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Costas here from Gold Rush Paranormal. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today's video was highly requested by my Filipino friends. And this is for Christine De Sera. Christine was a flight attendant. It was so, ito guys. Si Costas na my YouTube channel na Gold Rust. So, ito na guys, parang, ito na, yung unang day kung saan siya nakikipag. So, ito yung unang araw kung saan sinubukan ni Costas or Goldrath na kausapin. Pero, Yan, may sumagot ng may sumagot sa kanyang So yun guys, parang sinusubukan na niyang kausapin or kinokontak niya sa unang araw. So yun guys, yan, lima daw yung spirito na nasa kanyang parang nakakausap niya ngayon. Oh, hindi pa rin. Yan, parang... Yan, sumasagot yung... May sumag, sumasagot pa rin sa kanya. Pero hindi pa si Christine. Yes. 
Ayaw pa rin talaga maga, hindi pa siya, hindi pa dumarating yung kaluluha ni Christine sa puntong yan. Kasi sinusubukan talaga niya eh. Hindi pa rin nakokontak. Kumbaga, hindi pa nakakausap sa mga oras na yun, guys. Yan, parang hindi niya nakausap sa unang araw, guys. Ano kayo nangyayari? So yun, guys, gumamit na siya ng spirit apps sa kinabukasan. Ayan, parang si Christine na yun ba? Parang medyo nahirapan yung ating paranormal expert dito guys. Ayan, parang sumagot na. Sumagot na yung kaluluha ni Christine. Andito na. Napakadilin dyan guys. Kung makikita natin dyan, green yung nakikita natin sa video kasi madilim po yan eh. Oh, yun. Sumagod na. Yan, na-contact na, kumbaga. Kumbaga sa cellphone, na-contact na rin yung kanyang spirit. Kanyang spirit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
think I have it uh, to escape pretty fast uh, right now, so help a little bit with false positives, but this can be interesting. So there may be lots of different versions that are coming through. And we'll just hold it. Also, so just keep that in mind. Yeah. Um, I believe I just heard you earlier, um, Christine, just when I, before I even started recording. Can you tell us what happened, Christine? What happened to you? Connecting with spirit is not always easy. It can be difficult for me to connect sometimes, especially with a person that I did not know, and it can also be difficult for spirits that have recently passed as they are getting used to their new surroundings. Sometimes it requires several tries. This was my third session attempting to reach her. They say that you were raped and murdered. Is that true? Yeah, and I'm Yes. Did I heard you say um, now you, you were with Leba, your men, friends, and you were the only female there. You were celebrating overnight for New Year's Eve and uh, New Year's Day, and apparently you had passed away New Year's Day. Now, Christine, were you, were you raped? <laughs> Were you raped by several people or just one person? Now I noticed, uh, Christine, that at one point I was looking at CCTV uh, camera, I guess in the hotel, and it looks like you were having an argument with uh, one of the males there, and it actually got kind of physical. Who was that person? Can you give me that person's name? I'm not even sure if you, if if one of them was your boyfriend or not, uh, or if they were just all friends. Yeah. But. Uh, it looks like some of them might have even been friends of your friends. Is that true? Now, I noticed when looking at uh, photos yeah, guys, so I don't of your autopsy, it looks like you have on your, on your knees, on your legs on your arms. Where did you get those from? Did you have a confrontation with someone? Yes, yes. sir, yes. Yeah. Who was that person? Disappear. Can you give me that person's name? Can you give us a number, how many, how many people, how many of the men there raped you? Rape me slowly. They also beat me with, they raped me. Yan. Did they drug you, Christine? Drug. Yes, so. Yes, so. What did they drug you with, do you know? Christine, is it you speaking, or is there someone else with you that's assisting you? Because the died. Is it you speaking, Christine? Um, your mom is really upset. I'm 
understanding the song. She's very heartbroken about what happened to you. Do you have any messages for your mom? Is that anything you'd like to say to her? Parang tagalit yung kanyang binabanggit dito. Spoken just pretty well. Is it very clear that your native language is Tagalog? Yan, parang Tagalog yung binabanggit niya dito guys pero hindi lang um, hindi, hindi lang masyado maintindihan kung ano ano nga ano yung katagang kanyang sinabi. Uh, are you in a good place right now, Christine? Christine, uh, do you have any messages for your best friend, Ria? Uh, you, you two were very close. Do you have anything you'd like to say to her? Any information you'd like to give the investigators? Yan, hindi masyado na intindihan yung kanyang mga sinasabi dito. Any messages for your best friend, Ria? Ri, parang Ri lang yung kanyang napapanggit dito. Hindi na na kaya mabanggitin yung Ria. Alright, I'm gonna stop right there. And I'm gonna have to review it all. So yun guys, ang pakikipag-usap ni Costas sa spiritu ng kaluluha ni Christine Dacera. Yan guys, nung pinapanood ko yung video, nakakaramdam ako ng, nakakaramdam ako ng kilabot. Parang napifeel ko yung pangungulila ng kanyang mga pamilya. Yan. Condolence na lamang po sa Dasir family. Siyempre, ang kababayan ko po siya dahil isa siyang taga Mindanao. Siya po'y taga Jensan. So, sana um, nasa maayos na kalagayan ang uh, kaluluha ni kabayan Christine Dasera. pala inawa ng Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala ang kanyang kaluluha kung saan man naroon. Naintindihan ko yung nararamdaman ko yung pangungulila ng kanyang mga pamilya. Okay guys, so kung hindi pa kayo nakapag-subscribe sa Gold Trust Paranormal, please uh, hanapin nyo lamang po sa Bawandang ibaba sa description, ilalagay ko po ang link ng Gold Trust Paranormal. Salamat sa inyong walang sawang suporta sa aking channel. Ayan, road to 3,000 subscribe po tayo. Road to 2,600 na po tayo guys. Uh, sana po please suportahan ninyo ang kusinerong vlogger. Yan, isang magandang magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. Um, maraming maraming.